This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, from Brooklyn, New York, introducing an acclaimed two-time middleweight champion of the world known as the Miracle Man, introducing Daniel Jacobs. Hiding out of the blue corner, from London, England, here is a middleweight and super middleweight champion of the world known as the Dark Destroyer, introducing Nigel Benn. A lot of trash talk between... Here we go for round one. Nice counter shot with the right hand. He threw the hook, didn't land. Perfect counter lands. Oh no! Nigel Ben in big trouble. Oh, he's got him right where he wants him. Can he put him away? Another scoring shot there. Missed him with that uppercut. Welcome inside this unique environment, a beautiful theater, ready for a fist fight. God, I love theaters. For all these reasons, you can hear everybody in the crowd. You can hear the punches. The punches actually echo. You're that fighter coming in, and you know you're in such an, an intense atmosphere. You know what the pressure is going to be on. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. Nigel Ben has been rocked. I thought we were going to see the finish there. Oh, what a punch! Exchange here from both men. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. After what we saw in that last round, it's pretty obvious who has the advantage. Here we go. It's round two. Fighter relies a lot on their instincts and reaction time. You've got to get in there quick to punch your opponent before he gets his fist back to block. Still fighting the counter punch and you've got a dummy shot. Make them react from that, then react then. I know it's hard to think that way, but counter punches are watching you, watching your every move. Every throw. This is not the way he wanted this fight to start. Let's see if he can get out of trouble. And the referee will begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. Two, three, four, five. Can the Dark Destroyer get out of this dark place? the hook. That left scores. This is not, and down goes the Miracle Man. the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Both men. Let's get it started in round three. Looks 
some point, the corner needs to decide we have to protect our fighter. That was the moment. Back and forth they go. The Dark Destroyer now in a very dark place. It appears they weathered the storm. How? I'm not sure. This fighter it looks like we're going to see an early night here. He is rocked. Good job of cutting off the ring, making sure his opponent cannot get out of trouble. I thought we were going to see the finish there. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. Destroyer, get out of this dark place. Heavy shots, and Nigel Ben goes down. One, two, three, four, five, six. As we enter the final ten seconds here. Oh no, Nigel Ben in big trouble. So it's plan B time after being knocked down in that round to make or break a fighter. And there's the bell to start round four. the towel and they're gonna throw it in and it appears the onslaught is over at least for now the dark destroyer now in a very dark place to score with that left hook. That's another scoring shot. Final 10 seconds here, and I think he knows he's won this round. into this fight after the beat. Time for the fifth round. He couldn't write a script like this. Oh boy, the Miracle Man now in some trouble. Is this big opportunity to finish the fight slipping him by? How did they not go down? surprised if these two fighters go the distance tonight considering how much they do. This is not the way he wanted this fight to start. Let's see if he can get out of trouble. But somehow weathered the storm. Why aren't they keeping
keeping their gloves up. Mike. Shot. 